A while back we did a house tour here of Paris Hilton, one of my faves, so it seemed appropriate to do a video for her old partner in crime, Nicole Richie. I think they're still one of my favorite celebrity duos to this day. Currently Nicole is living in Beverly Hills with her longtime husband, Good Charlotte frontman Joel Madden, and they have two kids. In this video we'll see the previous LA spot the couple called home, the place they're currently living, and more. Nicole Richie is a TV personality, successful fashion designer, socialite, and more, who rose to fame with the reality show The Simple Life. Of course, she started in it with her childhood bestie Paris Hilton, and the pair was killing it. Show lasted five seasons, which I watched every one of, and premiered on Fox with a massive 13 million viewers. Back then, Nicole was known for her potty mouth and wild ways, definitely being the more outspoken one of the two. And she's always been hilarious. I think she kept that flair in her personality despite growing up and being a businesswoman, mom, and wife. Since then, Nicole has also been a mentor on NBC's fashion star, and from 2017 to 2018, acted as Porsche on the sitcom. Great news. At the time of this recording, Nicole is 38 years old. Despite the fact that she was always considered relevant for being musician Lionel Richie's adopted daughter at first, I think she just came onto the scene at the right time. She never let that define her and continued on to build her own empire with her brand House of Harlow. Currently, Nicole has amassed a net worth of about $15 million. Hey guys, it's Karen. Today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. Today we're going to be taking a look at where Nicole Richie calls home with her family, like her place in Beverly Hills, and more. These days, she's even turned part of their home into a mini farm with pet chickens, but we'll see that in a bit. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post. You can always be up to date. We've also done house tours in the likes of her old bestie Paris Hilton and Christina Aguilera. We'll have links to some at the end. Follow me on Instagram because I love getting to know you guys. I've also been reading all your comments and I'm going to be responding to some at the end. I need you to let me know who to do next in the comments down below and whose home you'd like to see. Now let's get into this video. First, we'll take a look at Nicole and Joel's previous house. This place was built way back in 1914 and was tucked away in the Hollywood Hills, right by the Sunset Strip. It was in the secluded neighborhood of Laurel Canyon, which is a mountainous area and canyon in the Santa Monica Mountains. Nicole originally listed the home for over $3 million, but the couple ended up selling it for $2.7 million. The walled compound sat on more than a third of an acre and inside spanned 6,300 square feet of living space. There were five beds and five baths. Inside the home had been extensively remodeled by the couple and featured plenty of wood accents and walls, vaulted ceilings, and natural lights. The wood beam great room was the center of the first floor where there was open space and walls of windows letting in sunlight. A massive skylight dome tops the house as well. The main residence had interconnected living spaces including a step down double height living room, a dining room with fireplace and wall of exposed brick, and a spacious dining kitchen with new appliances. The kitchen also opens right up to the terrace at the side of the home with built in barbecue area and outdoor dining which is pretty convenient. On the second floor there was a landing looking over the living and dining areas and a floating staircase leads to a walkway that links the bedroom wings on the upper floor. The master bedroom is privately located on its own wing of the house but its access via an internal sliding glass door. In the large master suite there's a fitted walk-in closet and another skylit master bath with double vanity jetted tub and a marble walk-in shower. Other features of Nicole and Joel's previous Hollywood home include an office, home gym, and an attached poolside guest house with access to the backyard. Not to mention the guest house offers an oversized living room with fireplace, full kitchen, a bedroom, and a Pilates studio or fitness room. Finally, outside the modern cabin style house you'll find the lagoon style pool with a waterfall spa and beach entry. There's also a play area outside and a patio with built-in seating. This house was also completely walled in private with trees lining the property too for ultimate security. Around 2015, Nicole and Joel decided to move their family to Beverly Hills and bought a house in an off-market deal for about $6.7 million. The home is located in the Hidden Valley community, which is an elite neighborhood and celeb fave. Some of their neighbors include Jennifer Lawrence, Adele, and Nicole Kidman and Keith Urban. Not to mention, Nicole's sister-in-law Cameron Diaz and her man Benji Madden apparently live on the same streets, and the women have been spotted grocery shopping together in the past. This community is privately patrolled, full of trees, and has minimal traffic going through, making it perfect perfect for high security and keeping paparazzi out. Nicole's current family home spans 5,515 square feet of living space
space with four beds and four baths. The house was built in the late 1950s, renovated since, and in fact, actor Jack Nicholson is said to have lived here through most of the 90s. Although the couple has kept the inside of the home quite private, it's designed in a contemporary yet vintage style. There are multiple fireplaces throughout and an attached two-car garage. If you follow Nicole on Instagram, you can catch glimpses of the house as well. A little stir. Got it. A little sip. Yeah. Ooh, stir and sip. A little stir. A little sip. A little stir, a little sip. You know? Mm -hmm. So it's really all about the rhythm. The general note, yes, is just like in joie, you know? The home is set on just over half an acre of land, and of course, there's a backyard swimming pool and even a sports court outside. Perhaps one of the most unique things about Nicole's home is that it has a personal farmstead. Current Beverly Hills home didn't have a coop at first, so Nicole needed to create one for Tallulah, Philomena, Mama Cass, Sunny, and Daisy, which are the chickens if you didn't guess. Nicole told Architectural Digest, The new house didn't have a coop. We had to build them one, so we did a miniature version of my own house in terms of color and style. I wanted one color palette throughout. It's gray. She also made cute little sections for her chicken pets, which were five small boxes for them to lay eggs. Although it was a sweet idea, they didn't really use them and just laid their eggs wherever they felt like. Although Joel isn't that involved with the chickens, it seems to be one of the things that Nicole enjoys most about their family home in the hills. Surprise. To lift your neck high, make it long, make your posture nice. You're a woman. It is our time right now. Her personal mini farm also has an edible garden, two turtles, and about 200 bees in two hives that make seasonal honey. Not to mention they have a dog, a cat, and a bearded dragon. Nicole also said that she was planning to add three more chickens to the coop, which by now I'm sure she's done. Stop moving. Always give a little variety, some passion. And just move around. Spread your wings. Just be you. Although I wish we could see more of Nicole and Jules' Beverly Hills home, I would imagine it's a mix of modern and classic and probably has a lot of earthy vibes. So now we've seen Nicole Richie and her husband Joel Madden's real estate, including the house they used to live in in Laurel Canyon, and what we know about their current family estate in Hidden Valley, Beverly Hills. What did you guys think about Nicole's homes? I really liked what I saw in Nicole's current place, like the earthy tones and the elegant master bathroom. I think my favorite part was the big backyard and her little farmstead though. It's a great way to take advantage of all that space. Okay guys, now I'll read out some comments from previous videos. On our Tom Hanks house tour, Richie Charming wrote, Hope he gets well soon. My heart prayers and faith is with the family. Excellent presentation, Kara always. Thank you, Richie. And on this same video, Nicholas763 said, I love your videos. This is one of my favorites. Keep up the great work. Every day I wake up, I always look for a video to watch. It makes my day happy. You should do a house tour of Jennifer Aniston. Thanks so much, Nicholas. I'm glad you liked it. And I'll definitely do one on Jennifer Aniston. So thanks for the the suggestion. Finally, Linda Wommeldorf also commented on our Tom Hanks vid. Nice homes. Wish Tom and Rita the best of health. Get well soon, guys. Love all of his movies. They are just nice people. I agree, Linda. I wish him the best too and a fast recovery. All right, guys, that's all I got on the iconic Nicole Richie and her homes in Beverly Hills she shares with her hubby Joel and two kids. We also learned that they share it with a bunch of chickens and some other cool pets too. What did you guys like best about Nicole's Hidden Valley property? Let me know in the comments as well as what other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to chat more and I'll see you all next time. Bye!